a man stay on top. Uh, they come to serve in the bar. When you hey, y'all, I just want to talk about something important that people nowadays really feeling unbothered and just feeling uncomfortable. Feeling uncomfortable about, you know, letting people understand. You got to know the difference between people who is going to see you want to stay down and you just keep on climbing to success. I mean, come on. The people that, you know, seen us that passed away that we truly love, do they want to keep continuing with seeing us mope around and want to see us go nowhere? Come on. You know your loved ones better than you know yourself. You know what they would be saying if they was alive. Pick your head up. Why are you crying for? Yeah, I'm gone. But you got to continue taking care of your family. Taking care of the people you love. People that depending on you. Want to see you rise to the top. And the ones that continue knocking you down and keep on putting you down in a back burner. Who are you going to help on the end? At the end of the day, you got to make that happen. You got to make that choice. Are you going to stay there and mope around? Or are you going to keep on doing, you know, what you had to do to rise to the top? See, I've been through a lot of people in my life that actually, you know, passed away. And it hurts my very heart. It kills my very soul. To people that I really love died. And I had to understand that, you know. But they made me stronger. They let me realize that I got stuff to handle. I got stuff to take care of. And I'm not going to let nobody put me down. I ain't going to let nobody stop me for taking care of my business. You want somebody to take care of your business? Nobody can't do it like you. So you got to understand. You got to feel comfortable in your skin. You got to feel uncomfortable. The stuff in life, we're going to go through this regardless. The things that we go through in life, we're going to go through. We're going to go through hurt. We're going to go through pain. We're going to go through stress. We're going to go through all that things. And we're going to feel uncomfortable. Are you going to feel comfortable in your own skin to rise to be better than who you are? Come on. We are kings and queens. What you think your loved one's going to sit back and, and have you sit there and cry about the situation you're going through? They ain't going to always hold your hand. They're going to die. Everybody's going to pass away. Everybody's going to go through that stuff. And you're going to go through pain. But guess what? Either that pain is going to help you get to success or you're going to keep on moping to get nowhere. It's up to you. This is my message to y'all. You know what I'm saying? I feel uncomfortable. And guess what? I'm going to do whatever it takes to rise to the top. And that's going to be in the respectful of the good way. Not nothing bad. Nothing I shouldn't be doing. The things I'm going to do in the right way to success. You know what I mean? I want us to grow. I want us to understand each other. Do you feel uncomfortable that you keep crying every night? Do you feel uncomfortable that you're living in the same situation years after years after years? Do you feel uncomfortable that you keep complaining to the same person that don't give a damn about you? You're going to keep on feeling complaining or you're going to get up and do something about it? It's up to you to change. It's up to you. It's up to you to make that decision. Nobody's not going to always hold your hand and guide you the way. Yeah, I'm going to pray for you. You can pray for you. That's the only thing I can do. The only thing that could put that success to, to action is you. So either you're going to tell you feeling uncomfortable until you get comfortable, or you're just going to keep on complaining and never get nowhere. You got kids. You got people that count on you. You make a difference within yourself. Make a change, y'all. That's the message I'm here to tell you. Like I said... Out of five people that I love is gone. And I almost killed myself. Almost took me off the edge. Couldn't think. I told my YouTubers that I'm going to take a break because my aunt Hattie passed away. I thank y'all for making me stronger and make me realize I got to keep going. My aunt Hattie's not going to want that for me. My mother ain't going to want that for me. My brother Kevin, my brother Young Sick, 
and Jermaine. They not gonna want that for me. Even my uncle Malik, they not gonna want that for me. They want the best for me. They want the best for me and my kids. They want the best to see where I'm gonna get to and, and succeed. It's gonna hurt, but it makes you stronger when you think about what they gonna think of. Think about that, okay? So I just wanna be that guy to uplift you, understand you, realize situations. It takes you to understand that. Either you wanna fight, or just continue to stand there and do nothing. You think about that. Later, y'all.